Yo, what's up, broski? Today I got some exciting news for you guys. Sage Mo Naruto's outfit is coming to the game for our COCs. Now, a guy by the name of Kodo tweeted out the leaked images for the outfit and weapons we'll be receiving. But before we get right into it, be sure to drop a like on this video, subscribe to the channel, because I'll be bringing you guys the latest news and updates for Shinobi Striker. Now, starting off with this first image here, we have Sage Mo Naruto's outfit. Now, to be honest, I was kind of disappointed that we'll be having to wear his orange jumpsuit underneath the cloak instead of being like some accessory, but I cannot complain too much. At least they're giving us something, something we've been asking for a while now, so it shows that they're trying and actually listening to the Shinobi Striker community. And here goes an actual endgame image of how the athlete will look for our CECs, and to me it's a solid 10 out of 10, but I'm not too sure if the scroll on the back is some sort of accessory or if it's a part of the clothing itself. If it is an accessory, that'll be mad. But if not, nonetheless, the outfit is still dope. Now the Shinobi Striker players are back at it again, trying to get us off these perks, because they know these games be getting a little bit too stressful. So they trying to provide us with these pills to pop to make us go crazy. But not for real though, man. I don't know if this uh, combo pill will be like, give us like some sort of attack boost or defense boost. I'm not too sure what it's gonna do. But nonetheless, we do have a new ninja tool to use for Shinobi Strike. Next, we have the new Ibari weapon for Hitler. Now, I'm pretty sure this might not be a weapon, like its own weapon, but I'm pretty sure it'll be like a reskin of one of the needle weapons. Not too sure though, it could be its own weapon, but I'm pretty sure it might just be a reskin. But we got a new weapon coming to Shinobi Strike, well, or a reskin of a weapon coming to Shinobi Strike. Now this right here is what I'm most excited for, the Glimmering Flames Ninja Tool, bro. Now, you can't tell me this don't look something like Yukito's Tilt and Storm 4, bro. Like, they're giving us so much like Yukito related like things to Shinobi Striker. Like low key, bro, I would not be surprised if she mess around and be the next DLC. Like who knows, I, I mean, this may be a stretch, but hey, it's a possibility. Like, come on, bro. Think about it, man. We already have her hair. We have, like, these claws that almost pretty much has the same move set as her. And the theme color of blue. And now this, like, bro. And last but not least, Shinobi Striker is going to bless us for Valentine's Day. Kodo tweeted out, a new chocolate cookie is going to be added. It basically gives us the same effect as the Halloween candy. So we get another pill coming into the game for Valentine's Day. And also, that's not it. We're getting a rescans of the claws. Kodo tweeted out. Also, a new Valentine's Day claw is going to be added, which is basically just a rescan of the usual claws, but with some new particles added. So I'm pretty sure, like, whenever like you attack your opponent, bro, like, like heart particles or something like that is going to like, like you know, come out the claws, or we might get like pink sparks, something though. You know, we getting something added with the claws though which is going to be pretty dope i can't wait to see how this uh this goes and i wonder if it's going to have like new combos or is it going to have combos from the kiba claws or the new blue claws all right that'll wrap up the video there is being boy blank place signing off peace